page, I came, this came to mind when I did the My Black Is Beautiful campaign. Mm. Because I would notice that certain people look a certain way and then use their looks to get ahead. Mm -hmm. And I wondered, because girls are all beautiful, you're curving, you're this, it's whatever true. whatever it is you represent, you represent a form of beauty, yeah. right? Because yeah. beauty is universal. Yeah. So every single person here, do you feel like you are a recipient of the pretty privilege? What's wrong with that? Is there anything wrong with being pretty and using it for your gain? No, I think, no. I think, first of all, <laughs> I think I haven't used my pretty enough. <laughs> Let me, let me, just about, you, about the intro yeah. you've done. Yeah. Yeah. Th that thing where you said that all of us represent some kind of beauty. First of all, I feel like as women, we don't really believe that. Yeah. yeah. We women believe that some people are pretty yeah. and it pretty, is yeah. easier for us to see other people who had, who've been the recipients of the pretty privilege compared to <laughs> Thank myself. You. Uh -huh. Thank you. However, however, my husband tells me that he wishes women could That's see themselves the way, the way, the way men, men see them. Because men think all of us, in fact, he keeps saying fearfully and wonderfully made. As in, because he, he, yeah, he he's sees, a church guy. Church no, guy! He is a church guy. 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 He is a I want you. I wish you. I'm not going to look at you twice. No, no, no. I wish you shall love me. No, I wish you understand the context in which he says that. He says that about when when a man starts inadvertently following a woman walking because he's gotten transfixed by the way her, her hips are moving. Mm. That's, 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 that's what he's referring to. Yes. Not, it's not a shpili like thing it. in yeah. any shape yeah. or form. Yeah. It's yeah. so that person doesn't have physical. Yeah, it's just that. Yeah. What if that's what he's wearing her hips. Yeah. Yeah. No, 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 no. He says, he says, no, he says, he says, and that's what I'm trying to say. He says that we, we, women cannot understand how much men think we are hot not even that's beautiful hot. hot and it's all of us so the point is so me i feel like when when after those a few of those conversations yeah. what i realize is we all receive that pretty privilege and different also for another needs. reason uh -huh. not just because we are pretty because also men are in my opinion wired to be solution providers so like if you're somewhere like one time i had when I was a new driver, I had managed to block myself between a parking, a wall, and a, like a, a <laughs> just, and the car could not move. And so I called my colleague, I'm like, oh, please, come and help me. And that time it's like two buildings away. I'm still in distress. Yeah, I, I, I did that. And, <laughs> and I don't think he did that for me because he thought necessarily I'm pretty. It's just, I am female and I am asking for help and men, Want to help? Like they like they, yeah, yeah. When you when you give a guy an opportunity to provide a solution, from that for us. Well, let me tell you. So talking about driving, I feel like as a woman, there's no excuse for you to be stuck somewhere. Like you're trying to get into the road. I feel like just roll down your window and smile. It works all the time. You does it what you have. Yeah. So that's why I'm like, yes. I'm like, is it, is it not a, is it, is it not a good that. thing Listen. to be able to do that? I think it also boils down to confidence. Yeah. You know? Yes. It's a me, it's a will I care if you think I'm pretty or not? Yeah. Imagine, no? Me, me, Nikki, when I like confidence that by the way today I know I'm looking hot. Mm. I know when I go to that audition, I'm going to get the part. Mm. I know that when I'm going to the office, I'm going to get that deal or whatever. As a businesswoman as, as well, I know I'm going to make them look at me twice like, damn, girl, you understand No me? questions, how much? Exactly. So <laughs> if I can use that yeah. to my advantage, or it just comes natural because I woke up feeling confident. It's not every day wake up feeling confident. Yes. Mm. So but that yeah. particular day, yeah. Hey, like, why not? Uh, 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 I, I will use it. Even unconsciously in the small thing. Yes. yes. Because it's that dress you wear. Yes. Yes, for me too. For me too. Or the is that. I think we do it. I feel it's 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 we started at a good name. point defining what pretty is. Because for the longest time, let me just tell you, I did not think I was pretty. The yeah, SI unit of what was pretty Imagine was not that. me. Yeah. Wow. But I'm so hot. <laughs> this <laughs> one day, my eyes just opened. Hey. And I was like, oh yeah! Nani huya! Hey! Look at you! Look at you! In fact, like, honestly, for the longest time, so I started growing boobs at a very young age. 
Defining what pretty is is some thin person who can hang on any type of cloth mm -hmm. and they act some kind of way mm -hmm. and it's just femininity. It's, it's, it's a feminine manner. As a thin person who can put into any type of cloth, <laughs> I want boobs, I want hips, I want ass. So even, I want us. So even thin no, people no, who no, are the air size, <laughs> I'm like, no. Like no. 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 when after I got my baby, I kept telling Jojo. I don't want to lose the weight. Please let it stay. Let it Please let it stay. Please let it stay. Please let it stay. Please let it stay. And then it all wins. Yeah, for real. So you're right. We all we all look at ourselves and we're like, I wish I had. I feel like and that's the thing that I feel that because of all those things that we think of, that that thing I was saying, you can always when you look at yourself in the mirror as a woman, there's always something you can improve. And because of that, I feel like a lot of the times we're not even aware. That you can, there's a there's a pretty privilege that you can tap into. At least speaking for myself, I feel like for me, if 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 I go somewhere and like my husband tells me, you know, sometimes when we go somewhere, the guards don't even stop you. They just let you pass. Him is being told where. So I'm like, I don't, I do, I do, I do not, I cannot, I cannot understand. Like when you say, when you now centers that to me about pretty privilege. Then I can, maybe that's what this is. But for me that's not what that is. Because in my mind I don't I'm not at that standard of me. getting but what I see is what I see is yeah, where now it becomes being a negative connotation yes. is mm -hmm. when you know okay fine maybe you've come into the realization that you're a beautiful chile, you're pretty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Your eyes have been open. Your eyes have been open, open. hallelujah. <laughs> but you start putting other women down mm. to make them feel bad about themselves so that you can get that job. Watching in Wambia is the auditions to Wait, Nandanga. put this word down so that you... Yeah, so that they can feel bad about themselves. Mm. So that, yeah, people play with your heads all the time. Like if you're going for an audition, right? Uh, maybe it's a modeling gig, an ad, um, whatever, TV casting. Mm. You see, all the mamas in walking here, on eh, what in here, this smart screen, ready, mm. mini, whatever. But always be that one, ah, guy, I wish you put more makeup. Mm. Or, yeah, blush would have worked. Why Ooh, didn't you? Yes, you understand? It's yes. like, so you're, you're Ooh, making me I'm feel. You're bad. Here for the audition. Hey, you're the audition. <laughs> like, you're also you did get the audition. So, so you you're the you know, yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Oh, no, Why did you wear heels? Oh, oh, no. heels, you know? Oh, no. That's. <laughs> oh, Why is that kind of ish? I have to give you this example. I was at a salon. And so I'm sitting down and I'm getting what, 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 what. And then this lady goes like, oh, I'm like, yeah. no. What? She's like, you don't need waist. No, no, a belt. Ah, you know a belt, you can get a waist. You know? Oh, I, was just like, wow. I was just like number wow. one. We don't know each other you, that I am from Kenya. <laughs> yeah. Wait, I am from Kenya. <laughs> Next time, that all happens. of my all this food is going to go here. It's not going to go here. Yeah, it's not going to go there. It's not Whoa. going to go to. The, it goes here. Yeah. And you know, Paul, I, let me tell you, I've struggled. I can't even. I, I that really lady, detest she was like so that. genuine. She was like, "Oh my sir, <laughs> no, no waste." <laughs> As if it was so what? genuine. <laughs> but I was like, "Anyewe." <laughs> But you know what? I bought a belt. Like maybe that was her belt business. I don't know. And I started wearing my pants you know up means? a bit so that it can go. That means she's the, way... the one who went through something like that. Then someone said something like that in to her. Salon, you'll always find that's people. terrible. Yes. It was it's, like, it's always in the salon. Why is it always in the salon? I didn't know about boundaries. That day I told Too many ako. I that thing you said about in salons, I don't know, yeah, maybe because it's a typically female space. Mm. Yeah, it's like the, yeah, at least the side of the salon that's for women. Mm. Like people feel like this, they are no it's familiar. Yeah, the people oh, feel familiar. Yeah, mm. and, just come and, and get, another get place I noticed, I noticed people feel familiar <laughs> is um, in in uh, prenatal clinics where everyone is pregnant. Mm. People just 
suddenly everyone just chomons something from their bag and start eating. <laughs> You're putting your feet up. Like, there are no... There are no... <laughs> and then people... Uh, one day we said asking each other, you why do we queue here for so long? Because the doctor is see you queue for hours and hours and hours. We were like, why do we queue so much? So people shared such personal stories so suddenly pack was like, what? And then we all agreed. After like three people talked, we were like, okay, we shall continue queuing. We all have very <laughs> personal stories which are intense and they they matter and that is why we queue, you know. Mm. So I feel like in those places also, someone can tell you. Gosh, you're only five months. You look like you're almost giving birth. Oh, <laughs> oh, I got that so much. <laughs> Women <laughs> are so. That's cutting. Yeah. So, so pretty privilege in conclusion is it's a good thing. We can use it to advantage, but let's not go overboard, right? Mm. Yes. Yeah. But what is the standard of being pretty? Pull up. I've still that, got That's what I'm saying. And that's what I'm saying. For women, we tend to have. We have a standard. For, yeah. for most yeah. men. Yeah. What yeah. For, yeah. Yeah. for yeah. most yeah. men. Yeah. Let's but switch it A up. woman is a woman is a woman. Yeah. Yeah. You know, the other day. <laughs> hey. Hey, social media. So the other day, um, I was just going through my YouTube channel. And then you know how you know I was just searching as though I'm a, a visitor mm. just to see. What well, Rachel is on YouTube, guys. Woo! Yeah. Yes. <laughs> no, no, well, Rachel, you know. Now I know. Now I know. Uh -huh. Then you know, in the searches, I'm like Molly well, Rachel's clothing. Um, it's like versus so and so. Mm. Who dresses? Who dresses better? Yeah. yeah. Who wore it best? Comparison. Not who even one. It was like a series of my fashion sense. Now umwengine. Nanani anakuangana the better fashion sense. Mm. So the the video first rain of the other chick, many pictures of her. Zangu luka kwa tatu ne. Either way ni sawa. And then now that's supposed to put a standard as to oh how a media personality is it's essentially supposed to supposed dress. To dress. Because wow. me, I'm not Baba Vum, mm -hmm. then how Jafika? Quota. Quota. I was like, wow. Quota <laughs> drew. Yet, yet, let me tell you how. Let me tell you how society is messed up. And especially the same girls who are there commenting, and of course, you know, passing more points to this other girl, they're the same ones who go and say, we like someone who's real. Mm. We want someone we can identify mm. with. Yes. We want someone who's relatable. <laughs> You're so Nearly relatable. Checker, you know. Have you checked the comments? You're so exactly. authentic and nika, relatable. Nika checka, <laughs> nika sema, oh my dear girls. Nyenye ambao mna admire huyu mwingine because of course they are gonna stylist around the clock mm. kama you know face me. I'm not like this every time mm. by the way. But this is just me doing my one two makeup. Mm. But you're supposed to be like you know what? Why should it care? Why should we care? Why should it matter? And we also, as females, whichever generation we're in mm. right now, we should also be vocal and, and point at these people who are trying to put one against the other mm. and tell them, you know what, we don't care. Yeah. But for the record, yeah. you're don't. always we bringing it. I've never seen you looking so good. No, well, never. Let me tell you you're something about always bringing it. Hey, after that, Kasumar, hey, you're yeah. always <laughs> bringing it. Like, standards. That you know. inconsistency is described, ah. in my opinion, is the reason why reality shows exist. It is therefore more interesting, because of that disparity in options, it is therefore more interesting to analyze what women wear. Ah. I, think that, I think that's a factor. But yeah, what it's a really factor. Saying is that the standards for women are ridiculous. Yes. Yes. Somebody yeah. Somebody sits down here. Yeah. Yeah. Some standards that are just crazy. crazy. I, I, came yeah. here, I came here with three outfits. <laughs> and I was like, hey, <laughs> let me not try. Yeah. I look too hot. Let me just <laughs> <laughs> you can tone it down for the rest I of like, the yeah. Thank you, we I thank you, Carrie. Thank you so much. I got all of y'all. I was like, I was gonna pick out one. I was so sorry. I was like, 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 I is when Miss Ashley called me and she said smart casual. I was so relieved because I was stressed. I was like, Aggie, what am I going to wear? Oh my god. 
As in, I've been talking about it the whole week. Even today, my husband was wondering, why have I not started preparing? Because I said, I went to, to pick an outfit somewhere yeah. very fine. I'm no, not wanting it. <laughs> my bed is full of clothes. Ah, so my kids were like, Mom, only oh, this clothes yeah. are for Ulena. Exactly. <laughs> As in, where is this? Today. Why you have Today. removed? Today, my bed is full of clothes, you know. And then eventually, my daughter told me, Mom, I think when you wear your jeans and top, you just look nice. And you know, that's exactly what I did. Aww. I put on my jeans, I put on my top, I'm like, because I had dresses, I was wearing a coat, I'm like, mm, no, this one is too official. We're looking for smart casuals. There's just one dress I had to wear, it had a hole. A lot of that possibility. It was really my makeup.